Hey guys, welcome to iTech Savvy. Today I will be showing you how to jailbreak your iPhones and iPads running on iOS 13.5. Now finally jailbreak has been released for all devices running on the latest version of iOS. I will be soon releasing how to jailbreak your device using your PC and also how to do it without any computer. This guide will also work on older devices. Now jailbreaking your device with computer is much more reliable than jailbreaking without it because you do not need to use any third party service to do this. The steps to jailbreak your device are to install Alt Server on your iPhone and then with the help of Alt Server, we can download Uncover app which will help in jailbreaking our device. Okay guys, so let's get started. So the first thing you need to do is to go on your Mac and open Best Tech Info on your browser. I provide the link in the description. Once you open the link, scroll down till you find Alt Server. Click on Alt Server then you will be redirected to a new page. You can download the All Store with the help of this link down here. After reaching the All Store website, you are prompted to download it for Mac OS or Windows. Click on Mac OS as we are doing it on Mac. Once it is downloaded, you need to drag it to your applications folder from your download folder. To do this, simply open your applications in your finder. Drag and drop all store on your applications. Once all server is installed on your computer, you will get to see that on your launchpad. Click on all server. It, it will ask for permission. Click on open. Now you need to install mail plugins. So open default mail app on your Mac and then sign in with your Apple ID. Use the same Apple ID which you are using on your iPhone. So go on this icon on your status bar, then click on install mail plugins. You need to restart your mail application after clicking this. After that, go to mail preferences by clicking here. After reaching the window, you should be seeing manage plugins. Now, if you are not seeing this manage plugin on your window, then you need to go back and check where you went wrong. And if you see manage plugins, you need to click on that and check this box. This will restart your mail app. After this, open your browser and download Uncover IPA by clicking this button. I'll provide the link for this website in description. Once Uncover IPA is downloaded, then save it to your documents on your iCloud drive. I have saved this in a separate folder in my documents, so you can do the same. After this, you need to connect your iPhone to your Mac. Click on Finder and go to your device. You need to trust your device from your iPhone, otherwise you won't see your device here. Now when you can see your device here, you need to go on All Store icon in your status bar and go to install All Store. Your device should be listed here and if it is not listed here, then you haven't connected your phone properly. If you can see your device here, then click on the device and then it will start installing All Store on your device. I have already done that, so I will be skipping that step. After this, you need to go on your iPhone. Go to the settings app on your iPhone and then tap general and then tap software update and make sure that you are on iOS 
After this, you should be seeing the also app on your home screen. But when you will click on it, it will show you that you are using an untrusted developer service. So in order to trust the developer, you need to go back to the settings and scroll down and go to device management. Trust and trust again. Now you can access the all show. Once you reach on the home page of your all show, tap on the settings below in the right corner. And then you need to sign in with your Apple ID. You should be using the same Apple ID which you use in your main plugins. Now as you can see that I have signed in with my Apple ID. After signing in you need to go on my apps and then click on this plus icon. Now go to the folder where you have saved your IPA file. Click on the uncover IPA file and once it's done you will see that there are two apps in this tab. Now your uncover app has been downloaded and you can see that on your home screen. Now click on your uncover app and you can see jailbreak written down there. Click on that and now wait. Then you will be seeing an ad here. Close this. After this your iPhone will restart. It might take some time so no need to panic. When it's done, unlock your iPhone and go back to uncover app again. Click on jailbreak once again. After this, when your jailbreak is completed, you will see a pop-up saying that your jailbreak has been completed now. Click on OK and it will restart your device again. So guys, this might vary on different devices and you might need to do these steps a few more times until you see the pop-up window saying your jailbreak is completed. Once your iPhone is restarted, you can see the Cydia app on your home screen. Now click on the Cydia app. If you can see your Cydia app, then congratulations, your jailbreak is completed. You can see that it's written here iPhone 11, 6, iOS 13.5. So that means that you are done and it's running iOS 13.5 jailbreak. Okay, so that's it guys. If you like the video, then please hit like and subscribe my channel for more amazing videos like these. I'll be also posting Cydia tweaks which you can download on your iPhone. So stay tuned and thank you guys.